Hello everybody, this is uh, Mr. Sechamba. Hopefully you are enjoying the video. If you are enjoying, don't forget to like and comment. Alright, so in this video, we'll try to discuss about uh, a cone, okay, in uh, menstruation. So, uh, you've got a cone right here, okay? This cone under menstruation, we, we may be asked to find the volume, okay, of this cone. So when we have been asked to find the volume of the cone, what formula are we likely to use? The formula that we can use to find volume will be equal to uh, volume, the area of the base, which is by R squared times height. So this is uh, the volume. Always when you've been asked to find volume of a, a cone, try to find area of the base and multiply it by the height. This is a formula we normally use, okay? At times, they, they write this formula as 1 over 3 base area times height, okay? So base area, the area of the base right here, which can be calculated using this formula, okay? So this is, uh, this is all about uh, finding volume of a, of a cone, okay? So now, let's say we've got, uh, they've given us uh, the diameter, okay? The diameter, let's say the diameter is 12 centimeters. And the height from here to here, it's uh, 15 centimeters, okay? So this is 15 centimeters, and they ask us to find the volume. So how do we find the volume of a cone like this one? We go to the formula, which is volume is equal to 1 over 3. Area of the base, it's pi r squared times height. So 1 over 3 times 3.142, this is the, the pi, okay, times the radius. Now look, they've given us the diameter from here to here, but we need the radius. So the radius will be half over of this, which is a 6. So just a 6 squared times the height, which is 15. So now we, when we reach this point, we get our calculator, we say 1 times 3.142 times 6 squared times 15. What are we getting? We're getting uh, um, 1,696.68. You divide by 3. So when you divide by 3, we are getting a 5, 6, 5.56 centimeter cubed. So this is uh, the volume.